What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, cups, and sides, and everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys. Yes, I have shades on, but it makes me feel cute. Just saying, just saying. Okay, so we're going to do it. I um, hope everybody's doing well. Um, I received a channeling. I hope everybody's doing well. It's not, it's not a good one. I don't know who this for. It's not a good one. Just trigger warning. Just saying. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm home today. Well, I should, usually I'm done by four o'clock, but, um, anyways, but I'm home today though, because I could not get over the hill. Um, y'all saw the posting on the community tab. If you did, I was stuck at like 7 a.m. this morning trying to go to the gas station before meeting, um, the other nurse this morning. We were supposed to meet at nine o'clock. So, um, I've been stuck at home all day because of this big ass icy heel. Now, is it thawed now? Yes. I just got out just now at four o'clock. Um, and thank God for that because <laughs> I cannot stand being, especially now being by myself. I don't even have my kids here. Being here by myself drives me fuck crazy. And that's just the truth. Um, I love being out and doing. So, anyways, that's why I'm here. Just saying, just saying. Tomorrow, I will not be on here during the day. Just a little forewarning. I will not be on here during the day, during the weekdays, okay? Okay. <clears throat> so, the channel message I received was, um, uh, I heard a Virgo feminine teacher I heard she intentionally lied on a, um, a femme parent um, in an investigation in the past regarding hidden Boyer cameras um, of the past. I heard she intentionally lied on her and there was stolen human traffic, human sex trafficking money involved in this in the past. I heard she is about to receive very negative karma. Um, I heard uh, her negative karma is basically she is a terrible teacher. Her, she's a terrible teacher. She's very unsympathetic, unloving, unkind towards her students. Um, and I heard a huge gossiper just now, a huge gossiper. Um, but her karma is she's about to get a lot of official reports. Um, I heard to, through the um, city school system. I did hear city. So I think she works in a city, city and ice, urbanized area. She's about to get a lot of reports through um, the city school system, official reports. Um, I heard she will be investigated. Um, I heard she probably will end up um, being terminated. It's about to be this bad. And I heard a lot of reports, at least 10, at least 10. That's a lot of reports. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. She's a Virgo femme teacher, but she's not a good teacher. Because you know, there's you can be upright in the universe in any occupation it doesn't matter what you are a judge down to a nurse to a teacher to a police officer to flipping burger, burgers at wendy's you can be upright or you can be not upright she's not upright she's a huge ass gossiper and she lied strategically lied on a femme parent sounds like in her school in the past public school public school and if she works in a public school and um, she intentionally lied on the parent. There was some kind of voyeur camera situation going on in the past. But she lied. And she profited off of this situation with some kind of human sex trafficking. But that it sounds like that's why she lied. But she's not a good teacher. And she's about to get um, terminated, it sounds like, after all these reports come in. Now, I feel for some, you might make the reports on her. She works in a city school system in a middle school. In a middle school. She works in a city school system in a middle school. And somewhere out in the universe. I feel for a lot of my collective or people about to view this video. However that resonates and applies. You're about to report her. It's an official report. It's not like you calling up and speaking to the principal. It's not like you calling up and speaking to the assistant principal. It is an official report that goes into the city central district. To the very, very big wigs in the educational department not the school it goes to the central school system the official reports do for anybody that doesn't know that okay so 
when you put the official report in, it goes to the main line where it's supposed to, not to the school. The central, okay? The very, very big wigs in the education department, wherever you're at, okay? Freemite doesn't know that. Um, so kudos to whoever is about to do this. She, you have tried to get help from her in the past regarding your child. Some your grandchild. And she is ignoring you. She, she acts like she's helping, but she's really not. She comes off very sweet in the real world. Very sweet. But actions speak louder than words because she's really not helping you, your child, or the situations of the past. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. So she comes off, she has a very sweet facade. She comes off very sweet, loving, and kind. Like an Empress energy or a Queen of Cups energy. But I heard actions speak louder than words. You can come across sweet, loving, and kind all day long. But what are your actions comparable to what you're presenting out in the universe? You can act sweet, loving, and kind all day long. But what are your true actions behind closed doors, behind the scenes, when there's true emergent action that needs to be taken? Like in this case, with your child or your grandchild. There's some kind of situations of the past, your grand or ch child or grandchild, where you needed her help or needed her assistance or needed her to help you with something and she basically didn't do it. She, it sounds like she ignored your ass. Uh, but she comes across to you and to the society and public in the world like she's giving loving and kind. But you know she's not because she hasn't helped you with this very serious situation. Whatever this is and how this applies. <clears throat> and I think that's why you're about to put the complaint in on her. Uh, for some of you guys, it could be something else. But you plug it in how it resonates. She's going to get at least 10. And um, Wow. Just saying. For one, a child is about to report inappropriate touching in a classroom soon. For one of you, she, uh, there has already been a report of inappropriate touching in the classroom in the past, and she has completely ignored it. Oh, my God. Whoa, this is terrible. What the hell? Okay, so there was some kind of inappropriate touching in a classroom in the past. Whether it was your child or ch grandchild, this Virgo Femme teacher. Whether you've already reported her with an official report to the city schools, city school system, central district, or you're about to. Inappropriate touching in the classroom in the past, for one. For one, it's upcoming. Your, your child or grandchild's about to report it. For one of you guys, it's already been reported to you from your child or grandchild. But she is ignoring it. She's not helping you. Meaning, she's not she's not taking care of... I mean, that's, that's sexual misconduct. And you can't do that in public in a school. That's terrible. You can't do that anywhere. But especially not in a school. I can understand why she's about to get fired. Holy God moly. Now, I don't know if this is her touching, inappropriate sexual touching, or it's somebody else, another child in the classroom, inappropriate sexually touching in the past or the future. You have to plug in and how it resonates, but somebody's inappropriate sex, inappropriately sexually touching your child or your grandchild, whether it's another child, another staff, or her. But it sounds like it's in her classroom, whether it's already occurred or it's about to occur. Let me pull one card. Holy shit. This is nasty. Kids and molestation doesn't mix. If anybody needs to hear that. You can't make this shit up even if you wanted to. <clears throat> That's what popped out. And it popped out the fury. Ending to her job soon. And, 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 and she should. She's pretty sick of that yet. If she doesn't take any action on molestation, damn. And here's the deal. She obviously is sick in the head with bad health because she profited off the human sex trafficking money in the past. That's probably why she's not taking any action on the molestation or attempted molestation or something else regarding inappropriate touching. A child or grandchildren either already happened or is about to happen. Damn. These reports are about to be very detailed and very descriptive 
and it's about to alarm the hell out of the Central School District office. Oh my God, upcoming reports, upcoming reports. Oh my God, upcoming reports. Okay, these upcoming reports are about to be very detailed, very descriptive, and it's about to alarm the hell out of the Central School District office. So whoever is about to report, if you're the one over here about to report with regarding your child or grandchild, they're about to be very descriptive, very detailed, and very alarming regarding inappropriate touching or touching or, ugh, that's just gross, of kids, um, of your child or grandchild or any other descriptive, in a, uh, descriptive, detailed incident regarding the classroom with her or not handling situation or situations. A lot of you guys, it's regarding inappropriate touching, but it really can be anything. But it's very descriptive, very detailed, and very disturbing. It's about to disturb the hell out of the Central School District office. And you're about to do an official report. And we have child reverse. So molestation. It's for some, it might be something more. Only you know the situation and story, not anybody else. But we do have child reverse. This is sick. Coffin, she's about to lose her job. She's mentally disturbed. You can't make this up. Through many shocking series of chain events, she will end up being put on the sex offender registry list. And she will end up losing her right to teach. She's about to be very publicly humiliated. And when this happens, she will out other sex traffickers. Oh my God Almighty. Whoa. Okay, so once she, the coughing in energy, once she loses, ends up losing her job, it sounds like it's going to start with the official reporting energy of you guys to the Central School uh, District Office. Some you've already reported, some you're about to. But once this occurs, because it hasn't happened yet, once this occurs, she will lose her job, coffin. Now, teachers have to be certified. I do believe they have to be certified or registered, something like that. I think they have to be certified. I have to be licensed as a nurse, but I think teachers have to be certified. I think. I'm not a teacher. But whatever they have to have, whether it's a licensure or certification or whatever it is, I heard she's going to lose it, and she should. And she's going to be put on the sex offender registry list. Whatever these detailed descriptive reports that have already come in or are about to come in, they're bad. And it's regarding inappropriate sexual touching for a lot of these situations. Some, it could be others. Um, it's sick. It's sick. And I heard once she ends up losing her job, her career, and gets put on the sex offender registry list, she's going to out other human sex traffickers. So she has connections with other sex, sex traffickers, and which would make sense because of the previous channeling of the past energy of her. She lied on a Fem Energy parent in her school regarding a hidden voyeur camera in the past, and she was profiting off of money from the hidden voyeur camera with sex trafficking of that parent and probably her kid or kids in the past. And she had help and connections to do it with other sex traffickers, probably in that school or in her community. She's a Virgo Fem teacher. She works in a middle school in a city public school district. Wow. <clears throat> These reports are about to happen fast. These reports are about to happen fast is what I heard. These reports are about to happen fast. Well, God, I hope so. All right. I love you guys so much. I'm getting out of this one. I can only handle so much of this one. I love you guys. Namaste.